Today, we have some interesting news about Khloe Kardashian. She still cares about her ex Tristan Thompson, whom she shares two children with. Let's get into the specifics. On Wednesday, Khloe Kardashian wished her ex-boyfriend Tristan Thompson a happy birthday via her Instagram stories. She shared two lovely pictures of the Cleveland Cavaliers star on social media. One involved True and Tatum, their children, while the other involved his younger brother. She tagged him in the first picture, where the family is exchanging gifts on the dining room floor and wrote, Happy birthday. Your mommy is proud of you. In an additional picture of him with his epileptic 17-year-old brother Amory, she wrote, Happy birthday. The caption alludes to the NBA player's mother Andrea, who passed away in January of last year from a heart attack at her Toronto home. Amory's official legal guardian is Tristan Thompson. A judge in Los Angeles County Superior Court granted Thompson's plea for guardianship of Amory on the 26th of February 2024, according to court documents. There have been many highs and lows in Khloe Kardashian's dating life. Kardashian and former NBA player Rashad McCants confirmed their breakup in January 2009, having started dating at the end of 2008. At the age of 24, Khloe Kardashian revealed on her blog, He's in a different city every day for games. Our time together was just so limited because of both of our schedules that we decided it is best not to be in a committed relationship. The last seven months have been great, and we will definitely remain close friends. In an episode of her E! series Courtney and Chloe Take Miami, the star claimed McCants had cheated on her, despite her earlier admission that the breakup was mutual. Chloe Kardashian had NFL running back Derek Ward for a couple of dates in 2009. That was the extent of their romance, however he did travel with the celebrity to Mexico to celebrate her sister Courtney Kardashian's 30th birthday. Khloe Kardashian and Odom got together at a party for fellow NBA player Ron Artist in August 2009, and a few weeks later, they were engaged. The couple got married in an opulent ceremony in Beverly Hills nine days after becoming engaged. The couple, who co-starred in two seasons of the E! reality series Khloe and Lamar, which focused on their life as newlyweds, appeared to be enjoying themselves. However, following months of rumors regarding Odom's drug use, Kardashian filed for divorce from the player in 2013. The divorce papers were signed in July 2015, but Kardashian postponed the procedures to assist Odom in getting well after he was discovered unconscious at a brothel with narcotics in his system, a few months later. In the month that Kardashian filed for divorce from Lamar Odom, she started seeing Matt Kemp, an outfielder for the Los Angeles Dodgers who had dated Rihanna before. Following Kemp's Instagram photo of Kris Jenner's Christmas tree, romance rumors started to circulate, although neither of them ever officially acknowledged their relationship. At the time, a source claimed, they are just friends and have been for a long time. Chloe is absolutely heartbroken right now over Lamar and dating someone is the last thing she's thinking about. Following their brief courtship, Kardashian and rapper French Montana, whose real name is Karim Carbouch, were first spotted together in April 2014. That summer, the pair spent a lot of time together, including at Kardashian's 30th birthday party in Las Vegas. They had a brief breakup in September 2014 and made an attempt to get back together, but ultimately called it quits in December 2014. The rapper talked candidly about his bond with the reality star in 2019. He said, I feel like we had a real dope relationship. There was no bad blood, nobody did something to somebody that we couldn't come back from. When the love was like that, it's always going to be like that. Friendship after a relationship is something that's real hard to do, and I'm glad we've been able to do it. Rick Fox, a former Lakers player, and Khloe Kardashian went out to dinner late one night in May of 2015. Around 11.45 p.m., the two were observed entering separately, and they stayed until 1.13 a.m. Though their romance didn't develop further, the outing undoubtedly generated romance suspicions. In July 2015, Khloe Kardashian and James Harden, an NBA player, started dating. The reality star said that January, that the two were able to make time for one another despite their hectic schedules was due to her ability to multitask. Khloe said, I mean we make it work. We do make it work. I do like to put my relationships as a priority, and I really try to make that work. As long as people are making the effort to do so, I think anything can work. In spite of their best attempts, the two split up in February 2016. 
A source claims that when Kardashian's ex-husband Lamar Odom was admitted to the hospital in October due to a drug overdose, their relationship deteriorated. In order to aid Odom in his recuperation, Kardashian raced to his side and put her divorce procedures on hold. It hasn't been easy. James obviously has wanted to see her more and be with her more, but she's felt like she needed to stay in LA, to be with her family and to deal with Lamar stuff. That has put some strain on things. As she endured with Odom's health concerns, Harden was empathetic, stating he had been very supportive and awesome. Chloe said, I'm just allowing everything to unfold. If it's ever too overwhelming for him, then I understand that as well. Kardashian and Trey Songs were spotted cuddling up at a Las Vegas nightclub when the artist was performing in July 2016. The next month, the two went to Kevin Hart's wedding to Aniko Parrish. A source said, they are talking and hanging out, but it's casual for now. Although both Khloe Kardashian and Tristan Thompson have insisted that Thompson was single when they initially got together, the NBA player and Kardashian started dating in September 2016, the same month that the player was expecting his first child with his ex-girlfriend Jordan Craig. The couple spent the holidays together and made their romance on Instagram official in January 2017 following months of public appearances and lots of public displays of affection. After Khloe Kardashian gave birth in April 2018, Thompson was seen in New York City with another lady, which sparked a wave of cheating claims. Even so, Thompson was there when the reality star gave birth to their daughter True. A source close to Khloe at the time said, Chloe is being the bigger person and letting Tristan bond with their baby. Chloe Kardashian was prepared to give Thompson another shot despite the controversy in order to protect their daughter. She is committed to keeping her family together. And Tristan has shown that he is committed to Chloe, so Chloe will make it work. But in February 2019, a little over a year later, Thompson faced accusations of having an extramarital affair with Jordan Woods, a friend of the Kardashian family, the best friend of Kylie Jenner. Khloe Kardashian retaliated on Twitter, accusing Thompson of splitting her family, after Woods acknowledged in an interview that Thompson kissed her, despite her denials of wanting to pursue him. Kardashian swiftly recanted the claim she made, stating, I'm a roller coaster of emotions and have said things I shouldn't have. Honestly, Tristan cheating on me and humiliating me wasn't such a shock as the first time. But Jordan is not to be blamed for the breakup of my family. This was Tristan's fault. After pausing their love life to concentrate on their role as co-parents, the couple reunited in public for the first time at True's first birthday party. A source claimed that Khloe Kardashian and Tristan Thompson were giving their relationship another try in July 2020, and by August of that same year, it was official that they were back together. Despite continuing to peacefully co-parent their kid, the couple parted ways once more in June 2021 when Tristan Thompson was spotted out and about in Los Angeles having parties with other women. When it became known in December 2021 that Texas personal trainer Marilee Nichols was having a child with Tristan Thompson, there was yet another fight. While expressing regret to Khloe Kardashian, Thompson came clean and acknowledged that he had cheated on her with Nichols and was the child's father. Kardashian and Thompson revealed in July 2022 that they were expecting a boy through surrogacy for their second child. The baby was born on August 5th. His name is Tatum. Khloe Kardashian revealed that she had permitted Thompson to see their son's birth at the second season premiere of The Kardashians on Hulu, but she was eager to close that chapter and be done with this trauma and put it behind me. In December 2022, Kardashian had a lie detector test. Her sister Kourtney Kardashian Barker questioned her and demanded to know if she was still sleeping with Tristan. Khloe said, no, I am not. I'm really not. I would die if it said I was. Kardashian replied after the polygraph examiner verified that she was telling the truth. Tell us in the comments what you feel about Chloe wishing Tristan Thompson a happy birthday. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more updates on what's happening with your favorite stars.